Hello everyone, on our last video what I showed you was using the Kodika editor to create our interface. So I've downloaded my uh, project. You've got download HTML on the top right. I downloaded it. It's on my desktop. If I go look in my desktop, I see something called Kodika app dash whatever. That's your project. So if you open that zip folder, inside you will see another folder called mobile website. And our whole project is inside of that folder. So I'm going to drag that to the desktop to unzip it, to extract it. So on the desktop now, I've got a folder called mobile website. I need to get that folder into my Eclipse project. And that's a simple matter of drag and drop, actually. So I'm going to drag mobile website folder into my www folder. You could call this folder anything you want actually or leave it as is. Just to show you, I'm going to call this my last name. That is, I changed the mobile website folder to my last name. I'm going to drag that over to the www folder. Make sure it's the www folder and then it'll ask what do you want to do about this. Select how the files and folders should be imported into the project. Make sure you select copy files and folders. So I'll click OK. And now the result is that I've got this campus folder inside of my project. Inside of the folder is all of the code we got out of Kodika. You'll notice another index file and that's OK. We can have two index files. This one is in the campus folder, which is our main app. And then index is our root index file, the first screen we see when we load the project. If we were to run this project right now, we would not be able to see the index inside of campus because there's no link from index to campus. So let's create a simple link, and we'll do it better next time. But let's create a link in the index file, the root file, after the word welcome, after line 34, uh, I'm going to add a, um, a simple link that says enter. So this will be the A tag. So A slash A. And then inside of the A, we will select href. So href equals quote, end quote. And then in order to connect with that index file, it's inside the campus folder, index.html. So this simple enter link will take us to the index file in the campus folder. I'm going to save that. I'm going to run it. I'm going to go back to my virtual device, wait for it to load up. There it is. I've got that enter. It looks very plain. We'll fix it. And then I click enter. And here is what I downloaded from Kodika. I can click and drag. I can click these section headers and they open up. And I can start to fill in the content. So you see, I didn't have to create all of this from scratch. I used Kodika, which is based on jQuery mobile, to drag and drop widgets into my interface. And then I'll do the rest in Eclipse. Now there's a few things I actually need to do to get this really running properly. So on our next videos, we'll talk about setting up our supporting files as local files. Very important. So come back for that.